Hello everyone and welcome back to the last installment of The Tiger. We are going to talk today about the Metal Tiger. I am Richard Figarelli and I am your guide for, the chi for Chinese medicine and Chinese astrology. So without further ado, let's get talking about the Tiger itself and what the Tiger means before we talk about the Metal Tiger itself. So the Tiger itself is all about passion. It's about intensity, it's about power, it's about brashness and just doing things and jumping forward and getting everything taken care of and doing it in the most awesome way possible. So what happens when you add metal in on this? Good, old, ice, cold, hard, cutting, metal. Well, something really interesting happens. Metal makes the tiger extremely intelligent and a little bit dangerous. Remember, Tiger is all hold, called, card, logic. Metal is all about cutting and severing and then adapting and changing, assuming they have the ability and new information to do it. And Tiger is about brashness. So this will hem in the Tiger. This will bring the tiger's passion back just a little bit to where there's, they're not this wild, crazy type of tiger like they would be with the, oh, wood or fire tigers. The metal tiger is going to be, well, let me see here. Our system isn't working. We need to change this, and I'm not going to stop until it's done. I need to go talk to people. But people are stupid. So how can I get the people to do exactly what I want them to do without them knowing that that is exactly what I want them to do? So this person is going to be extremely good at mind games. This whole person's life is going to be chess. I would expect to see a metal tiger starting a company out of nothing. This person is literally making diamonds out of dust because they have figured out how to do it. Because tigers won't stop unless they realize that the venture that they are in is completely pointless and stupid. So, a metal tiger will dive in to whatever it is that they're doing, but they're going to do it very, very quietly. They will get help as they need it not because they want to be surrounded by people or worship. They prefer to keep the masses at a distance. They prefer to have a very, very close knit of people. A really, really good personality example of this would probably be somebody like Lex Luthor from Superman. Sorry about the copyright. Uh, DC Comics owns Superman. I do not. DC Comics owns Lex Luthor. I do not. So, he's extremely intelligent, very brash, wants to do things for people, but has an extremely violent temper when crossed, just like all tigers do. Which is going to be very, very natural to him. It's going to be very, very cold, yet kind at the exact same time. It's a really weird personality trait that you'll see. Uh, a very good place to see them is captains of industry, guys that come up from nothing. And they created everything that they have and something that everybody else wants and either can have and gets or can't have but wants, if you get my meaning. Okay? So, this has been my interpretation of the Metal Tiger of Chinese Astrology and Chinese Medicine. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe below. I like the subscriptions, they're cool. And if you would like me to actually run your Chinese chart, uh, feel free to send me a message at my website, vigintmed.com. That is short for Vigorelli Integrated Medicine, and I will be sure to get that chart to you as soon as I possibly can. So, when we come back next time, uh, we will be talking about the rabbit with his cute little earrings and what the rabbit means. And we're going to start off in the water rabbit. Hope you all enjoy.
You have an awesome day. Take care.